everybody, what's up? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Elizabeth Davis, if you're new here. I make mostly fashion videos, makeup videos, and lifestyle vlogs. So if that's your vibe, then definitely subscribe. Today, I am doing a little room transformation video for you. I have never really done like a room transformation. I actually, you know what? I did do one room transformation video when I first started my channel about two and a half years ago. I'll link it below so that you guys can see it. So you can see how much my room has really just transformed over the last two years. So I will link that below, but otherwise I haven't done a serious room tour where I like show each and every piece and tell you where I got everything. So I am going to show you guys what I got for fall, like on my fall decor. And then at the end we'll do a quick room tour. So enjoy, don't forget to subscribe and let's get right into the transformation. First, I need a more festive shirt because this blue tank top that I did a workout in is not making the cut. Should I put on my thin little cream sweater? I think I should. Just record me. She won't help me. Why are you laying down? You are not, you're a terrible producer. I don't care. I quit. <laughs> my gosh, I you're going to be fired. <laughs> I put my notice in. Okay, so yesterday I was wiping off my summer decor and then putting it away today. So, should I keep this out? No. This is my Valentine's Day candle. You need to throw it away. Why? It smells good. It's not. It's not going to my. Yes, it is. I've had it since February. Get rid of it. You're such a throwawayer. <laughs> this is Walt. He is my beloved child. She met him on Bumble. <laughs> it's my child, not my boyfriend. Oh. That's her cover. Okay, so my mother has officially been fired from her camera duties. Now she's just going to um, direct how to put things, where to put things. So she's now the interior designer. Her job duties have been... I want a laser. A laser? Yes. No, you're not getting a laser. Oh my gosh, I'm I not a cat. Point this stuff. No, you're not pointing to anything. How did you get this on here? Do you think I should just get rid of these? Yes. Okay. Because I don't think they're going to last in the box through the. I don't know if you know my body. They were cute while they lasted. But do you not think so? I don't know. <laughs> What's your idea? Uh, <laughs> let's just put it away. We're getting rid of these. I don't have to show my clothes. They're cute. What do you mean? This is my favorite pumpkin, Harry. Where should Harry go? Well, let me see what all you have. Okay. Then we have a bunch of little ones. I didn't know I had this color. That's cute. That's pretty. The seal's not going to go this year. No. These are from the Dollar Tree, all these little pumpkins. I got like, I think I got every color because last year I got like all but two and I felt bad leaving the other ones out <laughs> as if they're like, you know, kids. They're not. But then I got these colors too. So I think I'm gonna keep out the green and the blue ones this year. I should give those to somebody. I bet Jasmine would like them. Those are her colors. They're owls. I've had these for a couple years too. So a lot of this stuff is like at least a year old.
So right when you walk in, this is what the overview looks like. So I'm standing in the corner of my room right in front of my door. So this is just the overview. So here's my makeup stand. This is kind of like a work in progress. Now I plan to get like a real mirror, but for now I just have my ring light sitting on uh, sitting behind it and then I turn it on in the morning and use this mirror because the light on the mirror is really really dim so I can't really see then I keep my makeup brushes in this mug that I got from London which is a little bit like destroyed on the other side from the dishwasher but I was I decided that I didn't want to keep using it because I don't want it to get ruined so I use it for my makeup brushes and then this is my makeup case it's from Amazon and then I just have my little pumpkin fall scents sitting here so I don't forget to use them because I'm very bad about remembering to use like lotion and perfume and stuff if it's not sitting out over here this is like my necklace accessories hats belts all of that um I a lot of these necklaces are really old and like out of style so I need to go through them it's been a little while since I've done that and then this is my clothing rack my beloved clothing rack I got this from Amazon. The little pink hat is also from Amazon and the hat above that, that one is from, I think it was a Christmas gift. I wanna say my aunt got it for me from like Kohl's or something like that. Um, and then these are kind of like all of my go-to pieces for um, getting ready. This is my favorite dress right now. It's from Misguided. This isn't really like a clothing haul but I just wanted to highlight a couple things and then I bought this from the thrift shop. I think it's pretty cool. Love England. It's one of my favorite countries I visited. And then down here is just, I put my shoes. I tried to organize them by color and like fall boots. Like my, all my black boots are in the back along with some cheetah heels and then uh, cheetah booties, I mean. And then some clear heels in case I decide to like go out and I want to wear, you know, some fancier shoes that aren't boots. And then my tennis shoes my combat boots and then my docks are in the back behind these like chunky sneakers and then just like my majorette white boots is what I call them. Um, over here we have the curtains. This is one of my windows. I have another one if you saw already. The string lights on both my windows are from Big Lots and then the curtains are from, from TJ Maxx. Um, and then this little like broom thing is like a scented cinnamon um, like potpourri type deal, I guess you could say. I'm not really sure what it what it's called. My dad just bought it for me and I thought it was cute and very fall and it smells like cinnamon. And I only took off half of the plastic because I don't want my entire room to like smell really strong because I just got it like two days ago or three days ago. And so it's been sitting in the plastic, but I do want to eventually take it all the way off. I just pulled some of it down today. Coming over, this is my television obviously and i've got the fireplace going on youtube and then my dresser i'm not really sure where this is from i've had it for ages i've literally had it since i was like eight i'll have to ask my mom where i got it this guy is my absolute favorite you would have seen him in the transformation portion of this vlog it says happy harvest on the pumpkin his name is walt i named him after one of the irish dancers that i know because when we a few years back did the Wizard of Oz recital. He played the Scarecrow, Walt did, uh, this this kid named Walt, my friend. And so I named the Scarecrow Walt after him. And then I got this from Hobby Lobby. I think I got it two years ago, so 2018. I love him, he's my favorite. He goes out every fall, every year he gets a new spot because I always rearrange my room differently. Like next year, it'll probably be different from what it is today. And he'll probably go somewhere else, so. Um, this year he's going right here, which is nice because it kind of hides my ugly hamper back, back behind here. I like the hamper though because it fits out of the way where you can't see it. And I mean, it kind of sticks out a little bit, obviously. You can see it a little bit, but it's better than like hanging out like right in the middle of the floor. So uh, Walt does a little bit of camouflaging. Thank you so much, Walt. <laughs> and then this little pumpkin, he's so cute. I love him. He is from Dollar Tree. So I got this one and then like a bunch of other colors. I'll show you the other ones here in a couple minutes. But this one I got from the Dollar Tree. They had a ton of colors 
and I really like the white one. It's probably my favorite of all the ones I got. Um, then down here, uh, I have like this plant. I couldn't find another spot for it. Well, it's not a plant, it's a vase with some like olive leaves in it or whatever. I'm not really sure. My mom just, she calls it something. I don't really know plant names or anything. So I just call it whatever it looks like to me. <laughs> um, I'm not sure where she got the leaves, but the vase is also from Big Lots. So a lot of my items you're gonna be seeing are from Big Lots or Home Goods or Hobby Lobby. So that's where those are from. This is my beloved nightstand. Love this nightstand so much. It's from Home Goods. I love it because of the mirrored drawers and it's got a great deal on it. It was only like 150 bucks. And I also got this two years ago when I redid my whole room. So again, I'll link that video for you guys so you can see how my room used to look because it was totally different. Then obviously a Bath and Body Works candle. I got that last year. This pumpkin is from Home Goods. These two candle holders, these tea light candle holders are from Big Lots. And then the candles in there are also from Big Lots and I need to get some new ones because I don't think I have any more. So once these ones are burnt out, I won't have any more candles for my little owl holders. This is the bigger one. And honestly, this one is kind of hard to light because it's so deep. So, and then this is my Spanish Bible. I am a Christian, if you don't know, love Jesus with my whole heart. And I also love the Spanish language. I don't like how these lights are really uneven. I've tried so many times to like fix it, but whatever, it's fine. Nobody comes over anyway, nobody comes in my room. And then this is the one of the other pumpkins from um, the Dollar Tree that I got. And I just have it sitting on top of like this little vase. Don't know where the vase is from. My mom, I think I stole it from my mom. She probably got it from, honestly, Amazon or the dollar store, somewhere cheap. Um, home goods, maybe, big lots. We all kind of get our, all of our decor from the same places. I really like this nightstand setup. She kind of helped me, as you saw. I think it's really cute and I love it, love it, love it. So yeah. Then up here, I wanted to do something a little different with my shelf. So my mom came up with the idea of putting my pumpkin pillow up there because on my bed, it would just be too much because I have a lot of other throw pillows. The white pumpkin up there is from Home Goods, And then the two books that it's sitting on are from this thrift shop um, in Navarre. I live in Canton, Ohio. So Navarre is probably like 10, 15 minutes from me. And then the gold pumpkin is from the Dollar Tree. I don't know, it's between that one and the white one. I can't decide which one I like the best. And then I have this vase here that my mom gave me with some lights in, in it. Um, she probably got the lights from like Mark's, honestly, cause like this grocery store by us. And then the shelf was given to me, um, used to be like a wood color. And then um, my parents decided that they would paint it white for me and distress it a little bit. That was a really long time ago though. I've used this shelf for shoes. I've used it for Christmas decor, fall decor. I think Walt may have been sitting on it one year. I don't remember. <laughs> um, I'll have to go back and look at old vlogs to see where he was before. But yeah, it's always been in the same spot. It's just been very different purposes. And this year it is my fall decor. Then this is my bed, you guys. I love my bed. It's so comfortable. My grandma just gave me her old mattress because she got a new one. So technically it's a new mattress to me. Bedspread is from Home Goods. I got it a couple years ago. Um, it was in my room transformation video that I did a few years ago. Um, this happy pillow. Oh, I forgot to tell you. This uh, pumpkin pillow is from Home Goods. This happy pillow is from Hobby Lobby. That pillow back there um, with the wove woven pattern is from Home Goods. The pillow next to it, the white one, that one is actually, I kind of use it as a dual pillow because on the other side, it has snowflakes. So at Christmas time, I'll do like probably a Christmas room transformation and it'll be flipped around. So it'll stay that way at Christmas until after winter is over. Then we have Bunny, you guys. Bunny is my childhood stuffed animal. I've literally had him since I was probably two or three weeks two or three weeks old. Technically, I think it's Peter Cottontail, but, and then my little Cinderella pumpkin is what I call it. Um, it's from Home Goods. And then over here, we have this little guy. I need a pot for him, but I got him from 
Hobby Lobby in the spring. So I think I may have shown that in a vlog and I had it sitting where Walt is, but back a little bit. And then I decided to move it over here so that I'd have a spot for Walt. And then this is my mirror. Hello. My mirror is from actually this armoire that I used to have, like a big gigantic wardrobe that used to be where my clothing rack is. Um, it is literally enormous. So I took it apart and I kept the mirror. I had the armoire since I was a little girl. I still have the armoire, but it's just taken apart and put in storage. Um, so for now, I just have this mirror. I want to get a new one because this one is not the best. So yeah, that's pretty much it for the room tour. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you enjoyed seeing the transformation to where we are now. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. I would love to see you stick around for more videos. And I will see you guys in the next one. Adios.